No, I think what's happening with uh, with uh, Bora is that he had an outstanding game last time out. It's not just a day for Odisha FC as their unbeaten run was snapped short. The Kalinga Warriors went down to Chennai FC 1-2 in their 11th game of Indian Super League at the GMC Stadium at Bambulim in Goa. Ismail Gonsalves scored a brace for the Marina Machans while superb sub-striker Diego Mauricio pulled one back for the losing side. No, well, I know football. Not happy with the, the manner in which we gave up two goals, of course. Uh, not really happy with the manner in which we started the game because we started the game by playing everything long and not getting the ball down and playing within our shape. Uh, yes, yeah, so that sinking feeling I did have, but the game was not lost and I knew that we'd got to make a re- have a response. I thought the response was OK in the first half without being good and I thought the response in the second half was very good. Uh, I thought we were unlucky not to, to get something out of the game in the finish. Well, certainly the goals came from our mistakes. And, uh, I don't think that we were in a lot of trouble apart from that. And I think that they thought at 2-0, well, this, this could be over now. So it was an even game for the rest of the, the half. Possession, we played a little bit better. Uh, they wanted to play but they didn't get into the, those really dangerous situations that they that they wanted to. In fact, it was probably in the second half, we played we played good football, got into dangerous situations, and they only really should have maybe wrapped the game up at the finish when we were pouring people forward looking for that second goal. So you do that because uh, you leave yourself open at the back. and uh, But because we did that, we could counter-press better. And that was something that we wanted to do. And uh, at half time we spoke about that. We spoke about playing balls into the three forwards that we played in the second half. The full backs were going to gamble a bit and go higher. And I think we, we, we had a good 45 minutes football. But I can't be happy with the performance because we're just not doing those things that win games of football. No, I think what's happening with the with uh, Bora is that he had an outstanding game last time out and as a young player sometimes coping with success is as difficult as coping with failure and I think what he did he was worrying through the game about not living up to his star building last week and I spoke about that I spoke about that with him and I said don't worry because I'll stick with you now I think he started to realise that in the second half. That was strong. After making the mistakes he made in the first half, it was a strong character that played in the second half. But I hope in the future he doesn't need that sort of mistake to, to, to spur him on.